So the launch event was really powerful. I had no idea what to expect. When the group first came in, I knew it was a whole year from a school. They got to talk about some really emotional things. Today, they've all come in, they've all behaved so much better, really listening to Graham. I think he has their respect. When you meet someone, you're thinking, what are they like in your mind? You have to like, turn it off and just like, talk to a person that you didn't know much about without judging them. When I want a career and I remember people's names and their interests and stuff, it will make it easier for me to communicate with them. I learn about the business volunteers more and more each time I come. They know how to speak to you. You feel like you can speak to them. You feel like you can say anything. What you feel about today and how, what it's like at school. There's like no reason for a pecking order. At the end of the day, you're just the same as everyone else. And it doesn't make you like any better or any worse than them. I think a lot of people learn from this when they go back to school about how they feel about other people and when they're going to laugh at them or something like that I reckon I think back to this. It's a really exciting opportunity for our pupils. We always try and prepare them ready for secondary school. To walk into a hall full of older children could be quite intimidating. When they walk into secondary school that's just how it's going to be for them. It's a really exciting opportunity to develop their confidence ready for that. When I was coming in my heart was pounding like I was really nervous. The older students, they're honest and they're kind. We're talking about bullying. If you're doing it, you should stop and you should think about if you were that person. Now that they spoke about what they've been through and what I've been through, I actually feel quite confident to show who I am. So of the five steps, I think the one I'm seeing the, the biggest change on is confidence. So those that just weren't confident at all, now actually willing to stand up and lead a group of year sixes in a game or a challenge or just even having those conversations and that's making a real difference. The feedback we're getting from the volunteers is really positive. They're really proud now to work for an organisation that takes a real interest in terms of what happens in their local community. And it's just an incredible um, transformation that I've seen. And it's not about the academic learning, it's about learning for life. The children have just moved on leaps and bounds and, and that's it, that's the change. Do not change yourself, be proud of who you are.